Hello there, Richard from Digital Foundry here with a look at how the Star Wars Battlefront beta performed on top tier GPU hardware. Suffice to say that 1440p resolution at ultra settings is no problem for either the GTX 980Ti or the R9 Fury X. So the question is, just how much higher can we push the resolution? Can we actually run Battlefront at anything like its target 60fps frame rate at something like 4K resolution? Uh, well, the answer there is a pretty emphatic no, but the game's scalability still shines through, and using similar setting compromises to what we used with our budget GPUs at 1080p, we can actually get quite a remarkable experience on high-end GPU hardware. So we set resolution to 4K, and we keep settings mostly on high, but we bump textures to ultra and drop shadows and effects to medium. Now here's where things get controversial, as we drop the resolution scaler to 85%, effectively asking the game to render at 3264 by 1836. This gives us the balance we need to keep frame rates high, and we actually see the R9 Fury X take point here, with an overall 4% lead over GTX 980 Ti. Certainly as we move into the gameplay test at these settings, the Fury X does seem palpably faster, and there's none of that stutter in sight, and in fact we actually need to overclock the GTX 980 Ti to keep it above 60fps at all times. So it's an interesting question here, to what extent is resolution important? 4K is so pixel rich that it's unlikely you'll notice the resolution downgrade we've implemented here, but looking at still shots of our captures, the big leap in detail still pays off. Anyway, that's all we have for now. Please do give us a like if you found this video useful, and subscribe to Digital Foundry to make sure you don't miss any of our output. Thanks for watching.